It's a story about access, it's a story about women, and it's a story about leadership. My grandmother died from cervical cancer and it wasn't found out until it was too late. So I felt that their health-seeking behavior and certainly culturally and socially around them it wasn't something that was easy to discuss because, you know, it revolves around your reproductive health system. Women, generally, do not go for screening. The level of awareness is low and breast cancer and cervical cancer, if detected early, can actually be cured. They can also be prevented if only the women knew what to do. In Makweni, when they, the clinic was actually incepted, most of these people used to be terminally ill. Cancer was the number three cause of mortality in our facility. This gives cancer the image of being a death sentence. And personally, I'd like to change this narrative. So about three years ago, County First Ladies Association partnered with Roche, Women for Cancer, Africa Cancer Foundation, and International Cancer Institute to plant cancer screening clinics for women around the country. And to date, we have planted 14 dubbed Empower. The purpose of this was to bring screening to the doorstep of the communities. And that's what drives me. I want to see a situation in this country where getting treatment for cancer is as easy as getting your baby immunized for polio. If you catch the cancer early, you're able to treat it early. Now, the good thing is right now we have a dedicated unit whereby when women come for their family planning services, they are able to access advice and screening on the same. They are actually taught how to do this at home and what to report. And we also hope that there'll be a reduction of stigma when they realize that this is a common thing, it's okay to talk about it. This empowers them. They get to understand what to look out for in their body so that when they do go to a hospital to see a doctor, they can discuss these things openly. Na wakati huu nilikuwa mgonjwa kuna nilisaidia watu watatu. Nikimwambia nenda hospitali waangaliwe. Na mtu akisikia chochote, kimbia aone daktari. Initially there was no cancer clinic in the whole of Tetabeta County. Now care is close to home, it's close to family, so that translates to better outcomes. There is no loss to follow up and that will translate to more fewer rates. Hata mimi inanisaidia sana na ninashukuru sana. Na kila naweza kusema kwa serikali iendelee hivyo hivi na waurumie watu wa saratani sababu kuna mtu ana chochote. It's so important to invest in women's health. Women are the backbone of society. They are the nurturers. They are the ones who raise the future generation. And if their health is compromised, it compromises the quality of life of the children that they will raise. Five years from now, I see the Empower Clinic being the focal area in terms of cancer provision in our local settings, providing care that is affordable and accessible to all our patients and also our community. We at Roche believe that prioritizing women's health uplift families and communities at large. And that is why we are working together with partners, both in the public and private sector, to ensure that we have a healthier future for women in Africa.